welcome to another day. Uh, as I told you yesterday, we're going to head to do a day trip on Harlong Bay. Um, from what I've heard, by all accounts, the views are awesome, but the tours can be quite hectic in terms of how quick they run. Um, but we'll just see how it goes. Uh, I'll bring you along for the experience. And yeah, it should still be a pretty pretty good day. I'm hoping the weather's gonna be pretty good. Um, but yeah, we'll see how it goes because I'm a bit pessimistic. Crazy. Pretty epic view. 
quite crowded, but that's not too bad. Get ready, you can talk to the camera. No. Say, tell your experience. No. Go for it. No. Say it. No. How was that, Mum? It was revolting. How was it? It was hot, it was sweaty, and I got tired because I'm unfit. I need to get fit. Do you? Yes, I do. I don't think so. I think she did pretty well to get up the 200 stairs. Maybe not the 400. That was a bit disappointing.
Alrighty, so that was the surprising cave, surprise cave. It's pretty cool. A uh, couple of big, smaller caves, and then the big one, big chamber. Um, pretty awesome. A uh, bit crowded, but what can you expect? What do you expect? Um, but yeah, now walking back to the boat. Then we've got a so-called sunset party. <laughs> Not that I party. Um, and then we've got the bus back to Hanoi, which two and a half, three hours, so. Thank you.
next day. Um, this is just to sign off on the, the Halong Bay vlog and I went in with extremely low expectations just from things that I've read online um, of other people's experiences and things and I mean my expectations because they were low were blown completely out of the water. It was pretty epic. I think we got relatively lucky that it wasn't crazy busy um, because roughly two boats on each island when we went which was kind of lucky because uh, I've heard of like especially when doing T-top island like the hike to the top um, the stairs can get extremely busy it kind of would feel like Everest uh, with, with the stairs like up the um, Hillary staircase um, but yeah like pretty amazing day uh, I kind of feel very lucky to have seen it um, especially as more and more tourists start coming back to Vietnam. Um, but yeah, would I recommend it? Uh, probably, like the, the tour guide we had, Ken, he, he was awesome. Um, the only thing that was a bit of a struggle was the two of us. Uh, like the two of us is fine, just the seats were so hard. Like um, your, your, your bum went numb essentially and you're just constantly trying to maneuver your way around to stay comfortable but that's because you're spending almost six hours on the bus during the day so eh, I mean it's a you win and you lose kind of situation but yeah anyway signing off for today make sure you remember to like subscribe comment and share to your friends see if they want to go to Halong Bay or do something similar but yeah see you tomorrow I'll probably sign in straight after this see ya